$2 million have been invested in criminal justice reform right here in Louisiana. That money will help support victims of violence. Fox 44's CeCe Muzinga is here to explain how lawmakers are using this money to help lower the prison population. Ticia. Lauren Chad, good evening. A large part of that money will go toward building programs and a family justice center in East Baton Rouge. Commitments have been made in the past that weren't followed through. And now they have. Tonight, Governor John Bell Edwards announced new grants for criminal justice reform. It's expected to provide inmates with tools to prevent them from reoffending. The Louisiana Department of Safety awarded nearly $1.7 million to the Commission on Law Enforcement and the Administration of Justice for Victims Services as part of the reinvestment effort from the state's bipartisan criminal justice reform. The governor says the state saved more than $12 million as a result of the reform during the 2017 fiscal year. The law requires 70% of the savings to be reinvested into programs. 95% of all inmates are going to get out of prison in return. And, and reentry services, those programs programs prepare them for success. More than $700,000 will go toward establishing a family justice center in East Baton Rouge. It aims to empower victims of family violence with resources to maintain safety and stability for families. You know, for the first time in decades, we don't leave the nation in incarceration today because of those efforts. Now, the money is also going toward community incentive grants, victim services, and reinvestment and reentry programs. For Fox 44 News, I'm Ticia Muzinga. Ticia, thank you. Governor John Bell Edwards says moving forward, they would like to commit to the criminal justice reform effort and make adjustments along the way if they need to.